Hey, this is Jeremy at Docketwise, and this is a quick tutorial on using payment plans with LawPay on Docketwise. So the first thing I'm going to do is head over to my client, and I am going to create an invoice. And I'll select a matter, create invoice, All right, now I will add a charge. Let's say consultation, $500. There's my charge right here. And I'm going to scroll down here where it says payment plan. Turn it on. And it will prompt me to enter some information. Automatically selected is my bank account. Now, if this is a bill i'll have my operating accounts selected if it's a trust request i'll have my trust bank account selected and i'm going to select the installment amount let's say it's a 500 dollars invoice i'm going to charge the client 100 dollars per month let's start the payment tomorrow and I can choose to charge them every day, week, or month. I'm going to select month. Now I'm going to enter my client's credit card information. This is a sample credit card, of course. I read date and their billing address. And importantly, none of this information is actually saved in DocketWise. This is all going directly into LawPay. And I'm going to create my payment plan. Now, as soon as this is created, the payment plan is active. And based on how I've configured it, it's going to automatically charge the credit card on file beginning tomorrow, $100 every month until the outstanding balance reaches zero, at which point the payment plan will automatically stop. I can always come back and edit my payment plan here. And each time a payment is successfully made, my client is going to receive an email notification, which can serve as their receipt. And I'm going to receive both a in-app notification right here and an email notification based on my notification settings.